she said to me, the place quiet. I can't tell the quietness makes some noise. People cannot take the quietness because if they take the quietness, they will hear God's voice. Yes. Yes, it's serious, you know. Sometimes you have to walk away from the home and go out to the backyard where you can hear the birds, where you can hear the bees, and put chance you can hear God's voice. Amen. If there is time you need to hear God's voice, is now. Much was not said about Habakkuk's lifestyle. We don't know much about his lifestyle, but one thing we are certain of, his predictions tell us that he lived before the Babylonian invasion, which took place in 604 BC. The king at that time was Uzzah. And he was a terrible king. He brought in all kinds of changes, just like our government are doing. Bringing all kinds of changes are coming into our parliament, into our country. All kinds of changes. And they are not changes for the better. They are changes for the worse. Very soon we will be having passing bills about almost marrying, almost right in our little country. Yes, friends, you got to face it. Whether you want to or not, you got to face the times in which we live. And very soon we'll be having these bills passing. What are we going to do? What are we going to do? Because these changes are causing people to deny God. They are causing people to turn from God and God's law and God's way. Friends, I want to tell you people that the world is different from the church. God expects us to draw the world. He does not expect the world to draw us. We are to draw the world. But sad to say, friends,